Got old Chad up there driving, backing us down. Let's see if we can go catch some catfish here today. Pretty day. Well, it's the first week in March. We got some got some catfish nets. Uh, hadn't got into fishing real good yet, and we was wanting some catfish, so we went and put some three nets out five days ago. A little wire uh, reinforcement wire type nets in uh, Darbone here in North Louisiana. We'll show you a little bit about how we got these nets set up and see if we got, got some fish today. Hopefully we got a mess to eat. We got old big Chad up here in the boat again. Gonna see if we can get on these catfish today. I'm gonna tell y'all a little bit about our setup before we raise these nets. We got these three reinforcement wire catfish nets. These are just to catch blue cat. And uh, I'm gonna tell y'all a little bit about how I set this up five days ago. And uh, baited them with cheese to catch these blue cat. We're looking for some nice half pound, pound size catfish to fillet and make whole fries out of, put in the freezer. And uh, what we did, Right now, these fish are starting to come out of the channel. The water temps is about 54, 55 degrees, and these fish are starting to come out of the channel in deeper water, coming up into the flats, uh, staging up before they start spawning. And what we're trying to do is catch these fish in about eight to 12 foot of water out of the edge of the channel up on the flats. So we're gonna pick them up, see what we got, see how it worked out. Five days soak, baited with just scrap cheese, uh, from Net Company, and that's that's what we got going. We'll see what happens. We drop our headlines in and put anchors on them. Keep everything down out of sight where we don't have stolen nets. People bad about stealing your nets and stuff. So highly recommend to have you a marker somewhere and have your stuff down there out of sight where people can't steal your. So, I talked to one of my fishing buddies and 
it give me a little idea on on this right here to make it easier next time. So we'll see how this works right here. It's taking pull your drawstring up and uh, like so. Take a bungee strap, put in it. Run that bungee strap up into your wire. I don't want to crush that wire that much, so but it's gonna have to. Like so. And that should hold them hold that drawstring up tight. Should keep her catfish in there. That's a wrap. Alright, just hold it right here until we get let me spin the boat around. Alright, so just like just like our hoop net fishing, we're gonna, uh, even though we're in a lake, we got a little bit of current in this lake. So, always been taught and told to put our mouse downstream, so that's what we're gonna do, even in the lake. Now, people text me about how to put these nets and drag them up, and all that stuff. That's an inch and a half shaft, stainless shaft that I made a drag out of. Don't like my barbs no longer than that right there. It's a quarter inch stainless uh, rod for the barbs. I don't like any longer than that because you'll hang up a lot. And then just an eye up there. That's a good heavy, about a 14, 16 inch piece of shaft. Works real good for dragging up. And the other thing, the other thing is a quarter inch nylon rope. And the reason I like nylon is because you can you can feel everything with that nylon. You can feel that. I can feel that rope when I hit it. That head rope. <laughs> Got one hanging on the outside. Pull it up there out of off the phone. Let's move it. Heck, the ones that are in there, it's recording. It's record. I made a little bit of a mistake right there. We had a hole in it, and and uh, looks like a bunch of our fish probably got out. That was my mistake right there. I'm gonna see how well Big Boy can handle all this. They can do a little dragging up. All right. Tell me you think you hit it. Probably ain't gonna feel it if it's on the side of the boat. Yeah, I think you got it.
problems looks like. I threw some, but I um, had some bigger ones. In yeah, there, I mean, them's nice. That's what we're looking yeah. for right there, like that and that. Cheap. There it be. Nice little catch right there. All by speed. Not about catching fish. No. <laughs> about three or four years, I'm gonna get me a trike. You look like a trike. 18 footer with a 115. nets I made a mistake on one didn't have my tail tied up tight we got that fixed though I think managed to come up with a pretty good mess of fish we got all we want to dress nice nice mess of catfish out of three nets uh, people shoot me messages a lot of times wanting to know how to how to get started pretty easy way to get started with these reinforcement wire nets look right there we got us a nice mess of blue cat go home and get these dudes cleaned up looks like some good table fare right there pretty day out here today we got us a nice mess of fish we're gonna get home and clean them have some for supper know what he's doing back there tell y'all what though y'all be sure to subscribe to our youtube channel we fix and start putting out some good fishing videos and a lot more content we'll try to get back at it again we've been taking a break from it for a little bit but we fix and start putting some videos out so be sure to subscribe hit the bell check it to all like and share our videos comment on them we appreciate all that, and we're going to be out for now. God's country hunting and fishing, keeping it real.